It was light. It was fast. And for a time, it ruled the skies. But the real secret behind the deadly elegance of the Mitsubishi A6M0 was its beating heart, the engine. Today we're going inside the machine to discover the power, the design, and the shape that made the A6M0 a legend of the Pacific War. At the center of the A6M0 was the Nakajima Sake 12 engine, a 14-cylinder air-cooled radial engine. Compact yet powerful, it produced around 940 horsepower, giving the Zero a max speed of over 330 miles per hour. What made the Sakai special wasn't brute force, it was efficiency. Japanese engineers focused on lightweight construction and tight packaging. Every gram saved meant more range, more agility, and more danger for Allied pilots. Now, let's talk shape. The A6M0's sleek, tapered fuselage wasn't just for beauty, it was born from aerodynamic necessity. The radial engine sat inside a tight-fitting cowling. Unlike American aircraft with bulky noses, the Zero's cowling was minimal. Why? Less drag. Even the engine exhaust stacks were positioned to subtly boost thrust, a design borrowed from racing technology. The engine was mounted with minimal bracing, directly to the lightweight alloy frame. That reduced weight and increased responsiveness in dogfights. But it came at a cost. Structural vulnerability. With the Sakai engine and aerodynamic shape, the A6M could outclimb, outturn, and outrun most early war allied planes. But this performance came with sacrifice. No armor, no self-sealing fuel tanks. The Sakai ran hot, and the Zero couldn't take many hits. It was built for speed and surprise, not survival. A samurai soared in the sky, sharp but fragile. Today the sound of a Sakai 12 engine firing up is rare and haunting. It's the echo of a forgotten era of hand-built machines and relentless innovation. The A6M0's engine may not have been the most powerful, but it was a masterpiece of balance, a symbol of engineering tailored for a singular purpose. The heart of a legend isn't just horsepower, it's design, sacrifice, and a will to dominate the skies. Enjoyed this dive into aviation history? Hit that like button, subscribe for more deep tech breakdowns, and comment below, what aircraft should we cover next? Thanks for watching my video like, and subscribe for more information video.